Capricorns. It is Capricorn season. So today was the day where as though I got around today. And what I mean got around, I had to go in like my hood and other places where I know that it's my birthday. They know I'm coming. Well, I rephrased that. They didn't know I'm coming. Everybody thought I was going to come on my initial birthday to come and collect my money. But that's not what was going on because I was like... Listen, if I come on my birthday, that's just like too much running around. And my birthday, honestly, I just want to chill. Like, I'm not really trying to like be out. I just want to thank God and like just chill. Like, I'm not like a lot of people, they want to rip and run and all that. And not me. People give me gifts and give me stuff because I deserve it. Not because they just want to give me something or something like that. Like, I literally look out for people like all year long like i'm not just a me 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 person you feel what i'm saying a lot of people's me 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 and then wonder why it's so much stuff going on but anyway i went and collect my money but i went to the mall i went and got some stuff so i never got to like really see how much money that i collected you feel what i'm saying i went and got money from everybody but before i start counting my money i know y'all know about um the smell the lady, she wrapped it up. She was like, because I was on the phone. She was like, it's your birthday. Oh, you need everything neat and pretty. I was like, I know that's right. I got love spell. Y'all, this shit here. Listen. Mm, mm, mm. And right now, I ain't got no meaning. But she gave me, like, a, a coupon that I could use on my birthday. I was like, damn, that's my birthday. She's like, you got a certain percentage off. On a full price or something. And I think I'm going to go back just to go get Love Spell again. And I bought the lotion. No deal. <laughs> you feel me? No deal. I was shocked too. I'm like, damn. They having like a $6 sale, but I ain't getting nothing $6. And I ain't like them sales. You feel what I'm saying? So, I went everything. Remember, I told y'all I left with $3. No, $4. That's it. I didn't, And my, my tank was basically on E. I said, fuck that. I'm not spending none of my money. I want birthday money. That's it. So, I went and got birthday money. And I'm going to count and see. Plus what I spent. I went to Macy's. I went to Nordstrom. I went to Forever 21. I went somewhere else. Oh, I went to Walmart. Yeah. this. So, that's 100 that's i forgot who that's from but like i was just telling everybody listen i just want hundreds of fifties like i really want all hundreds do you caught me at the wrong time everybody said i caught them at the wrong time but they was giving me my money how i'm gonna catch you at the wrong time these are some ones here this is probably some change i caught everybody off guard i don't be fucking playing i be too nice to people so when i called they they see me they was like oh shit yeah i pulled right up on the blocks <laughs> By real, real niggas. All right, motherfuckers, that be all acting like girls on the low. Fuck out of here. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. This is what I come back home with. I left with $4, and this is what I come back home. This is a boss, bitch. You feel what I'm saying? Who you know come leave home with $4 and come back with this? Shit, I don't know too many. I'm about to count and see how much I done grabbed up. 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. All right. And then it's 10, 13. So I literally went outside this morning. I think I put a video with $4. And I come back with one. Make sure I'm counting like two, three, four, five hundred and thirteen dollars Subtract. I think I spent like $280 in them all. This is what I'm telling you. I don't, like, I don't be playing. And this is just today first stop. I got some stops to do. The, the Mars is heading to West Philly. You feel what I'm saying? I'm heading to West Philly. <laughs> you know what I mean? And everybody probably like, I wonder where that money going. <laughs> where it's supposed to go. I'm not spending no more money. I went out, treated myself to what I wanted. That's it. I'm not really. Now, I'm trying to do something. I'm keeping low that I'm, you know what I mean? I got to, I want to go to this, like, little thing. Cause I want, I just want to go dependent. I might change my mind. Like I'm a person that just like, like, like to, to stack my money. Like I'm a stacker. I, I, that's all I've been around was people that stack their money. Like they stack their money, like stack their money. 
You stack your money. People need to know how to stack their money. Stack your money. Stack your money. So happy birthday to my motherfucker Capricorns. Go get your gifts. You feel me? You might got to drive. Because motherfuckers ain't going to come bring me my gifts. I had to go. I was, it was crazy today. I was in Jersey today. Now tomorrow, I'm planning to get in my little car and whip it to West Philly. To my stomping ground. Yeah. To go get my gifts. <laughs> and then the gift's going to go inside ATM. I spent no fucking money. I look like I spent no more money. I am good. I'm not spending no more money. I'm waiting for tax season now. Because I'm definitely not spending my money. You feel me? I'm about to get plastic surgery in September. I'm good. Pay my bills, chill. Happy birthday. That's what I came in. Got bags, bags, bags. I'm going to open my shit. I got too much shit. I'm done. I gained two pounds. Two pounds, yeah. Dolls. That's in Spanish. Yeah. And I'm going crazy. That's not what I'm trying to gain. That's not what I'm trying to do. So, I'm going to be back with my full water. No more airheads. No more mashed potatoes and rice. And all that shit I was cooking. And all having a ball cake and ice cream. And I was wild. You feel me? Yeah. So, Capital Wars. This is the energy. I want to see what's the energy that's surrounding you. We'll see. Okay, two come out. Death card. Something is ending, Capricorn. And watch their body language. So you may have somebody around you that be trying to plot some type of death on you. I just say what I see. You know what? I, I'm not, I can't come out with nothing else. Because if you got to watch somebody's body language, you got to be on point with somebody. Somebody may be trying some slick shit, Capricorn. So watch their body language. I always was taught that. That's why I, I, I have. I don't play with my guns. Oh, and I bought me a new gun. I, I'm not putting that on, on, on the web, though. I'm a queen of pentacles, bitch. Sit down. Yeah, somebody not budging here. You did have the death card reversed, so it might not. Somebody may not be budging here. Somebody may be stalking you here because you're the queen of pentacles here. But you don't give a fuck. That's on them. Yeah. In the past, you didn't know which way to go. Somebody got a negative judgment against them here. With the king of cups, somebody want to offer you love or sex, but you don't want that shit. Somebody unhappy because you happy, Capricorn. You already know. Happy, Cappy. They don't like that energy, Cap. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my boss-ass Capricorns? Yeah, you come up out of leaving somebody out in the cold. You may be dealing with legal problems here or somebody was in the past. Somebody from your past is coming back to your energy I'm seeing, Capricorn. Yeah, they're coming back. Somebody from the past. Wow, the King of Pentacles. Somebody see you as the King of Pentacles, Capricorn. Or this could be an Aries on another Earth sign and want to come to where you offer you love from your past. Yeah, you've been patiently waiting for this, Capricorn. Yeah, but this person look like they betrayed you and made you unhappy here. You're going to get everything you wish and hope for, but this person is a hater here. They was hating on you in the past, and they hating on you now is the energy. Yeah, this person is not really working at this time either. You're going to have to watch this. Yeah, you 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 you're strong. You're gonna you're gonna overcome whatever this is, or they see you as strong. But I definitely see it's gonna fuck up your money. Yeah, it's gonna make you unhappy, or you could be dealing with somebody that's unhappy. It could be a Leo. Yeah, you got a new beginning. You had a new beginning in the past, cat. Yeah, they can't make nothing happen in your energy. It could be a fire sign. Leave these people alone. It was too many ups and downs. They slowed your money down. They under ever heavy anxiety. They could under they could end up in the future in jail. They was lying in the past. They still lying now. Yeah, they keep a secret from you, Capricorn. Could be dealing with a Leo. Holy Spirit, what is the energy surrounding my boss ass Capricorns? Holy Spirit. Damn, all of them fell. I'm going to put them all back. There were too many. What is the energy? Yeah, you're coming up out of thinking about something you lost here. Person, place, or thing. Yeah, you're making something happen. You're coming up out of thinking about money all the time. You already know how it go. Yeah, you're coming up out of having a lot on your plate. Queen of Pentacles, your money coming in good. Good luck is on your side. But you don't have your guard up for some bullshit here. This is somebody that don't love you, Order Divine. Yeah, you're closing cycles with these motherfuckers. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? 
Yeah, a lot of secrets came out here. You stand to yourself. Somebody's definitely in de devilish energy, but you're not moving toward them here. But it seems like they're trying to move towards you, Capricorn. Happy birthday to my motherfucker, Capricorn. Yeah, because you're the king of pentacles. You come up out of dealing with immature persons. This person fake is fucking. You got other options. Or you will have other options. Could be dealing with a water sign. Sweet spirit, what is the energy? Yeah. You got everything to be balanced here. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? Yeah, you the ten of pentacles. These motherfuckers is liars and fake here. You don't want nothing to do with them in it, with them snakes, them peasants. They're peasants. Holy Spirit. What is the energy? Yeah, you come up out of backstab betrayal. Lies here. Yeah, somebody is slowly moving towards you. This could be a Gemini. Or you coming up out of making a decision that need to be made. Yeah, you come up out of confusion as well. Holy Spirit, what is the energy? Yeah, you don't have a whole world in your hands here. Yeah. You may, you was feeling trapped in the past, but now you the nine of pentacles. Pot out, bitch. Yeah, you not budging. I love it. Don't budge. Let them be where they at. You don't need to deal with them fucking scums. They scum of the earth, Capricorn. Yeah, their ship's not coming in at this time. Yeah, they don't know which way to take you here. Yeah, it could be three peasants in the past. Masculine, feminine energy. Yeah, they got a failed victory with you because secrets came out. You took a chance and left them motherfuckers out in the cold. And you can't build nothing with whoever or whatever situation this is anyway. You offering somebody else your motion and you using your fucking intuition. You're not fucking around no more. You turned your back on something that no longer serves you. Bottom fucking line. I love it. That's how you all be. You got these peasants where they at. The trash. Yeah. You very spiritual. You could be dealing with a tar series. Somebody could want to marry you as well. Somebody could be getting engaged. You're coming up out of letting people plot on you. Yeah, because they not to be trusted. Could be dealing with a cancer. You're like, get the fuck out of here. I don't like you at all. Slow bus energy. Yeah, you give and take equally here. You balance out the scales here. Yeah, so they people see you as arrogant, but who gives a fuck? You like, I don't give a fuck about you. I don't know you. You coming up out of dealing with snakes. You're balanced as fuck. Good news is coming to you, Capricorn, in the future. You want to get some good news about something? Yeah, you come up out of being stuck in situations, Capricorn. You're not falling for nothing with this reading here. Yeah. You moving ahead and even the past behind. You like, I'm done. Air sign energy. We got fire sign here. Earth sign. You like, I'm done, bitch. Masculine, feminine energy. Yeah, somebody can't celebrate with you. Or somebody may be getting a divorce. Yeah, somebody can't have peace. Somebody don't got peace in their life. So they want to try and bring that bullshit to you, Capricorn. Yeah, it's a towel. You bought a towel moment to somebody, right? Sagittarius energy. Yeah, you cut them off with the truth. Bottom fucking line. Divinely guided. You happy as fuck. Present energy. You like, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you went in another direction. Left them bugs where they belong. In the trash. Yeah. They watching you here. They be stalking you. They jealous here. Because they're liars. You cut them off. You don't want nothing to do with them. Misery love company. Bottom of the deck. So Capricorn, you already got your reading, right? So yeah, I'm about to do what I need to do because tomorrow I got something to do. Again, always got something to do. What I just did with the money that I got today, okay. Because I'm going to take only a little bit to get me my little shape up. I love you, Capricorn. Again, misery love company. Three weeks from now, you may find out something. Three weeks from now, you may have to deal with this situation here. I love you. Do what you want to do for your birthday. You don't got to always, like, do all crazy stuff. You do what you do. So you have something for rainy days. So you could, you know, anything could happen. You need to have some money so you could just do what you need to do. You might need to jump in a motherfucker car. You may need to take a flight somewhere. You may need money for you may ran out of something and you like, damn, I ain't got no money. But you do got money because you, you got that shit on the low. You feel me? You keep money for a rainy ass day. You don't you don't go spend money on bags, $500 sneakers, 500 bags, which people I, don't, I found out, they not paying all that. They be fronting. You know what I mean? Then they they stressing later if they spend that. But you don't got to spend money, hundreds of dollars on stuff 
you know what I mean, to show off for people so people could know you still got it. You do that when you do really got it. And then you could go ahead and you could go get stacks real fast. You feel what I'm saying? And, 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 and take care of your business. You feel what I'm saying? That's how I was taught and raised. You feel what I'm saying? Peace. And my Capricorns. I still didn't open half of my stuff. Like, I went shopping again today. They had like an awesome sale. Like, I'm telling you, they be having some shit. So, I got some stuff today. But I'm going to start opening some because I have my laptop over here and my new radio system here. I just didn't get to it because like... I don't know. I just always wait like my birthday and the day after and I open up some of the gifts. Some of the stuff I already open is upstairs, perfume stuff. But I went to Victoria's Secret, y'all. They had some shit. I mean, they had sell items, but what I got was no sell item. I just, y'all already know how I roll. I love sales. Don't get it fucked up. But the smells I needed is called Love Spell. Oh my God. It make you, it makes somebody take their clothes off. It is some shit. My uh, daughter-in-law had it and I've been, I, I got it from her, and I, I haven't been, I had couldn't stop using it. So, half of course, I just been getting it and getting it and getting it, and she was mad at me. Not mad. I ain't going to say she was mad, but just think about it. Your mother-in-law, come every time she comes, she's spraying your love spell. That shit's expensive any fuck away. It was no sell. I'm like, damn. So, I had to get the lotion and the spray. Um, I'm probably going to have it for summer more, so. It's going to be in my bag. But I got just so many varieties. So Capricorn, yeah. Capricorns. I also gained two pounds. I don't even want to tell my doctor. Two pounds. I don't got to tell her. She already know. Two pounds. I flipped the fuck out. That's why I'm having a ball. Holidays is the fuck over. I ain't trying to get no motherfucking weight. My plastic surgery appointment is scheduled. To September, I think the 14th, which I'm glad so I don't gotta be around certain shit. And um, because I ain't get down to my BMI that I'm, I have to be, and something that's going on with me, they want to disappear completely before I get the surgery. So Miami had to change my appointment because my doctor says she's not giving me a clearance for that, and they have to clear me first. So yeah, I've also been going January the 10th is my plastic surgery day, but it just got changed two two weeks ago. So, my doctor said she's not filling it out. So, I was like, damn. So, that's changed. You feel me? I ain't mad because I got I to gotta be healthy. I'm getting a full mommy makeover, which comes with a breast uplift, breast reduction, BBL, a whole tummy tuck. You feel what I'm saying? Then I'm going back and get some other shit. So, yeah, I, I, I feel my doctor. I ain't mad about it. You feel me? Because I still look good anyway. You feel me? People be like, you don't need that. Stop hating. Don't tell me what I need. This is my body, not yours. And you're not paying a 10000 So just sit down some fucking where mind your business. That's what I tell people. Sit down somewhere. Mind your business. You're not paying these 10 bands. <laughs> I am. <laughs> Bottom fucking line. So, yeah. That's what I'm doing, y'all. I Like, I wasn't eating these snacks. These been here. But I was, I'm a, it was an airhead and my doctor brought like, two pounds. She's like, you going crazy over two pounds. She said, if you, and I didn't get on the scale for a couple of weeks. I get on the scale, but naked Capricorns. So when I got on the scale, I almost passed out. I can't move the scale all around the house to see if my floor I'm <laughs> It's not the floor. I gave it two fucking pounds. And I don't feel it. But guess what? I don't want to see it the fuck either. So, yeah. I'm back on my shit, Capricorn. Mm -mm. No way. I like my little cute drip. Got my little stockings underneath. Looking cute. These are the new uh Nobody seen these. I got these from Nordstrom a year and a half ago. I just wore them the first time. Probably the only time. Yeah. That's a little cute, you feel me?